Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to run Stable Diffusion online for free. We will be using Mimic PC, which gives us GPU resources for free, or at least some credits for free. I will leave a link down below in the description where you can get the free credits. Mimic PC is a bit like running a virtual machine online, and um, it's very easy to use. There are ready-made apps in here and in this one we'll be using the automatic 1111 stable diffusion so let's just click on get started and let's get going so here we can also select the hardware which we want to use so with the medium one we get a t4 with 16 gigabytes of vram which is fine for this use case it costs 0.49 dollars per hour so let's just create and start. And now it's delivering the machine. It says that this can take 30 seconds to two minutes. So I'll, I'll just pause for a second here. So now it's running and there's a timer up here. We have connection error out. Well, that's strange. Never happened to me before. Okay, so we have text to image and we have image to image and different options here but let's try the text to image and we have different stable diffusion checkpoints we can select here on top by default it's going with this one so let's try that and let's find a good prompt okay i found the prompt online the image features an older man a long white beard and a mustache wearing a turban he has a stern expression giving the impression of a wise and experienced individual. The man's beard and mustache are prominent, adding to his distinguished appearance. The close-up shot of the man's face emphasizes his facial features and the intensity of his gauge. In addition, I just changed the width and the height to match a YouTube size thumbnail, not changing now any of the other settings here not really that familiar with it so let's just press on generate and see what happens so now we saw it said waiting and we see something starting to appear this is now in real time so it's i don't know it said at some point about 30 seconds so let's see if that's realistic okay it's it's done <laughs> and i find this a bit surprising why do you have two images here maybe it somehow misinterpreted the prompt to understand that this is kind of two uh, faces time taken 27 seconds so that's not too bad uh, i think we can download it from this button here let's see yes and I think the result is quite nice, but let's see if I try it again, will it again give me two faces or just one? I'm pressing on generate. Okay, I got again two faces. This time it took 25 seconds. I'll download this image as well. Kind of fun. Let's try a third one. This time it took 25 seconds, but I find the image it's almost like the same. I'll try to change the prompt up a bit. Just took some periods out and added commas. So let's do one more. So I'm pressing on generate. Now without the commas I got just one man, but it, it's very on the side, which is surprising. Maybe it doesn't really like the width and height settings here. Let's try one more. Okay, this image maybe is the best one thus far, just one image and well, it's a bit to the side, but quite nice. I like this one the best. If you found this video helpful, please give it a th thumbs up and thanks for watching.